be close to the mic, sir? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Good morning, everybody. Uh, first, before we say, I'm sorry, right here? Right here, okay. Good morning, everybody. First, I'd like to say, uh, before I say one word, our thoughts and prayers are with Gabby and the families here. This is tragic, uh, but I will tell you, this tragedy brings us all together. I couldn't be more proud of Chief Todd Garrison, Sarasota Sheriff Kurt Hoffman, the FBI, and all law enforcement agencies that are here today. This is my first time being here. Uh, we have deployed, Chief Garrison and I have been in constant contact since the beginning of the incident. We deployed assets immediately, resources, deputies, our Farrell system, which can analyze a crime scene and save hours and hours of, of man hours. Our drones, the Dragonfish. Dragonfish has the capability of flying 67 miles an hour and 18.6 miles away from the operator with the FLIR and all the capabilities of a helicopter. Today when I walked back there, I got to see firsthand the treacherous conditions that they were working on. We're talking about water levels up above almost the chest area rattlesnakes, moccasins, alligators, and these heroes go out there. While we can't change the outcome, we can bring justice. And today I'm very, very proud to say that Chief Garrison and our team of law enforcement, which is regional, it doesn't matter what color patch or uniform you wear, we work as one team and one family. And the law enforcement community came together, and I'm very proud to be a part of that. Chief Garrison, like to say a few words? Well, thank you, Sheriff. Uh, it means a lot. Um, as we said yesterday, not one agency can handle all of this. And it's important that we rely on our partners. And uh, Sheriff Carmine Marcino and Sheriff Kurt Hoffman have been uh, huge, huge players in helping this uh, investigation throughout, also with the FBI. So I just want to say thank you. Thank you. You know, it's uh, challenging times. I know everybody wants to know exactly what's going on every second possible. Uh, all of America is watching, okay? But we'll never, never jeopardize an investigation to give that information out until the time is right. But again, I want to reiterate, this is a difficult business we're in in law enforcement. Things change by the second, by the minute. These are very, very difficult conditions. I mean, you're searching in areas that you just can't walk up. And look, it's not like you're searching a house or a car. These areas are huge, and they're covered by water. So I couldn't be more proud of the team. Once again, I mean, Sheriff Hoffman from Sarasota, we're all one family. Sheriff's done a great job. Chief Garrison and our FBI, second to none, they came, they came together from all over. We're talking about, you know, different states of communication here. And the end result is one team, one family working to bring closure. Again, our thoughts and prayers are with the family members, and um, it's tragedy. Thank you. Do you think the Laundries would have cooperated sooner, that you would have found him sooner? Was this a press conference to just say thank you? Chief, is there any new information? Was there any point of the press conference? What was the point of that? 